Hi, this is Theo from PuckerBlocks.com. Today I want to show you this book that I bought last month. This is called Drawn the Art of Ascent by Jeremy Collins. This is quite an engaging read. Let me show you what's inside. Jeremy Collins is an artist, a mountain climber, a storyteller, a man of many talents. This book, Drawn the Art of Ascent, is actually a travelogue sketchbook. A book that collects his experience, the stories where he went around the world to climb the different mountains. He climbed in North America, South America, and the Himalayas, the so called North, South, East, West that he referred to in the book. I actually found this book on Amazon. I did not know what this book is about, but it's sort of it's sort of like a travelogue sketchbooks. That's why I bought it, and I really love the artworks inside. Check out all the watercolors, the very detailed line work. I read that he drew some of this while waiting for the weather to clear because it can be quite dangerous to climb when the weather is not uh, good, like when it's raining or when the storm clouds are coming. Those are quite are dangerous situations where you don't want to be climbing. I really love the the way he wrote all this with hand handwriting. Very very personal. And the stories are also very personal. One of the more touching stories inside the book, which is this one, is about his friend and mentor who died while climbing in China. So um, his friend is called Johnny and he because of that, Jeremy Collins decided to bring like his ash to all the different mountains around the world so that he can scatter the ashes at the summit. These are some of his mountain climbing friends. Talking about his mountain climbing friends, I'm actually quite surprised to um, find out that his wife actually let him go on so many journeys. So at the front here, I found this message here dedicated to Trisha who lets me go. This is quite um, quite nice. So along the way he also drew the people he met and also the things that he saw. This is somewhere in China, the Himalayas. This book is actually quite thick so there are a lot of wonderful sketches of people, the location, the mountains also. And it includes some animals. Photographs are also included, like a montage. I love the layout of the book also. And when you're reading about mountain climbing um, in this book, you can learn a lot about mountain climbing as well. The challenges they face and also the dangers. And another good thing about the book is this book actually reads some sort of like a thriller. Like uh, it can be quite intense at times because when you are flipping the pages you do not know what's going to happen next. For example, in this in this case, um, some guy was um, walking around in the wild, and then there's a grizzly bear. So it was quite dangerous. And many times, while Jeremy Collins was climbing the mountains, he actually slipped. His gear broke loose, and he hit against the wall. That happened a few times. So when the first, for example, right here where he actually fell because his gear came loose on the mountain. That happened quite a few times in the book. So when it happened the first time, it makes you wonder whether or not it's going to happen again. And indeed, um, in the later pages, it happened a few times. So those are quite intense uh, situations. And that actually made this book quite a page turner, quite exciting. You can see this is quite uh, a serious page. All right, I think that's uh, all I want to say about the book, so I'll just fast forward to the back. 
So now he's back with his family and kids. I love travelog sketchbooks and I think this is one of the better ones because uh, the stories are really very good. There are the low moments but there are also quite a lot of high moments. So I actually read this book in just one sitting. I, could, I wasn't able to stop because um, I found the stories to be really engaging. By the way, he also has a video made, I think a documentary made, you can get that for additional cost on his website. I will post a link to his website in the video description below and also post a link to the tax review if you want to buy this, if you want to know where you can buy the book. So um, that's all for my review today. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comment section below. I will feature more travelog sketchbooks in the future, so remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video, bye!